Hello, Mioni here, and I'm back with another Glamour video for you today. Today I want to look at a Final Fantasy X-2 Glamour. Recently I've had the urge to play the HD remaster of Final Fantasy X and X-2 again, and it begged the question what Glamours we could make for the characters from that game in Final Fantasy XIV. It came to my attention, people had beaten me to it, and indeed there were some incredible glamours from that game, including one for Len, the songstress character trapped inside the dancer dress sphere that Yuna equips and sings in during many excellent cutscenes. So this will feature a glamour created originally by Malkir, a person from Ragnarok server, the very same as myself, props to you. From the top then, this is the Expeditioner's Tabard, dyed royal blue, since I had so much blue dye left over from the Performance Police video. There are other variants of blue that would be better suited, and the glamour post actually shows the use of woad blue, so bear that in mind. The Expeditioner's Tabard is a Weaver Craft from Master Weaver 4 and is a 3 star level 60 craft. Alternatively, it seems you can get this really from Palace of the Dead Spoils on early floors from Bronze Sax. The arms are the Favnerian Armlets, these are a Master Weaver 3, 1 star level 60 recipe. Dyed the same colour as the chest, they do suit it quite well and do mimic as closely as you're going to get to the original outfit. The skirt is the Cashmere Skirt of Healing. This would lock the Glamour to a healing class. However, you can easily use other Cashmere Skirts, such as the Aiming one, which is very similar. Or if you have it, you can use the Moonfire Fair Skirt, as it would make it usable by anyone. But this is one of the closest lookalikes to Len without the tights. This is a Master Weaver 1, 3 star level 50 weaving recipe. And finally, the High Summoner Boots dyed loam brown. These are from the Fan Festival event codes, which you can still purchase through the promotional website. However, the codes themselves expire sometime after December, I believe, so if you want the High Summoner set or the Abe set for male characters, you'll need to go and grab that before then. All in all, I think Malkir on Ragnarok envisioned everything I wanted from a Len cosplay. It's probably the closest you might get. There are tweaks here and there, but really it's hard to beat that chess piece for accuracy. Even though some of the details on it don't really work too well, it still gives the desired effect and instantly says Len to me. A link in the description will take you to the Eorzea collection page for this glamour. Let me know what you think below on this one, and I'll see you all next time.